Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Made it through with just a couple of scraped knees back then. Back then? What do you say? We doing this? Have we? Never mind about that. Right now, you need to focus on yourself. Move something. Anything. Why not? Good. Easy does it. Slow. Slow. And steady. Yeah, yeah. Hey, uh, who are you? <laughs> who are you? I am your everything. <gasps> Hello in there. Oh, Cloud. There's still so much to be done. <sighs> Maybe you're not okay. He lives. Finally awake, are we? You're... Aerith. It's Aerith. And you are? Cloud. Nice to meet you again. Again, huh? What? You don't remember? What about the flowers? Oh, the flower girl. And this is... An old church in the Sector 5 slums. You came crashing through the roof without so much as a lookout below. <laughs> Fell right into my flower bed. Lucky for you. Uh, like, really. Uh, uh, s sorry, I, I didn't mean to... Don't worry about it. They're a lot tougher than they look. This place, it has a kind of power. Before I forget, you dropped this when you landed. Thanks. I've got one, too. You, and everybody and their mother. Not like mine, no. It's special. Mine's not good for anything at all. <sighs> Bet you just don't know how to use it. Could be. Though... I really don't mind. Just having it is enough. It was a gift from my mother. Pretty crazy, huh? Us meeting again like this. You should stay a while. Just when I had finished tending the flowers here, gotta start over. Just me, myself, and I. Back. We're not in any hurry. I could stick around a bit. <gasps> really? You will? In that case. Huh? I'll see myself in. Thanks. And who are you? He's my bodyguard. And a soldier. Pretty cool, huh? Huh? A soldier? Ex-soldier. Well, what do you know? You've got the eyes, at least. <sighs> you don't mind, do you? Bodyguard work's not too different from merc stuff, right? Huh? Uh... I guessed. From the sword. Just do this for me, okay? Fine, but it'll cost you. 
A lot. A lot, huh? One date ought to do it. Huh? Huh. Well, you're weird enough to be one. What class? <laughs> First. <laughs> if you're gonna bullshit me, at least try to make it believable. <laughs> Hey, watch the flowers! You heard the lady. I'll make this quick. You better. Body. Guard, huh? You know I'm... First two, right? Yeah. 
much as a scratch on her, you're done. Sir! We bring her in, in one piece. <laughs> what now? <laughs> Run! <laughs> Move it, I'll shoot! Oh no, you won't. But sir! <laughs> Could drop that. Okay. What's the hold up? I can't get to her!
Let's move. They're in the attic. Should we pursue? Got it. We are out. <clears throat> Beginner's luck. More of those things. It's like they're guiding us. Stay close. So cool. Huh. Gone? Yeah, I think so. What are they? I think... actually... I don't know. Let's just go. Okay. Up for crossing the rooftops? See that pillar over there? There's a station right by it. Shall we mosey on over? Let's. So, what's next for you? A little bit of bodyguard work. <laughs> Right. After that, it's back to the Sector 7 slums. You know how to get there? Yep. Of course you do. That suit from earlier. He was one of Shinra's Turks. What's a Turk want with you? Dunno. Hey, don't Turks keep an eye out for potential soldiers and stuff? They do more than just scout for candidates. Turks get called in to handle all kinds of situations, with extreme prejudice. <laughs> Professional bad guys. Gotta love them. Back to my question. So what's he to you? Looked like you knew each other. Maybe he thought I could be the greatest soldier yet. Forget it. Hmm? You mad? surprised if you had. It's honestly kind of exciting. Well, first time and all. of a soldier candidate? So petty. So, does no one live in these buildings? Nope. No one to get mad if we make noise. I'll go first. It's pretty old. Be careful. Okay. <sighs> Easy now. You worry too much. I'm not some princess who needs to be coddled. Shit. <clears throat> Whew. That was
was unexpected. Thank you, Cloud. <sighs> ah, there it is. The wall. You know, I thought about leaving once, but in the end, I couldn't. Too dangerous? Too much. The whole world bursting with life. Maybe more than I can handle, I think, sometimes. Even now. People hate the steel sky, the slums, but I don't. How could I? All that passion, all those dreams, flowing and blending together into something greater. This time I'll go first. After all, I can't count on you to wait. Sure about this? See for yourself. Hmm, maybe I'll go on ahead and leave you all by your lonesome. Just... Uh, maybe you shouldn't talk. Then you talk. Tell me a story. Not for free. Cheapskate, you're... Uh, 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 uh. Oh. Gotcha. You're killing me here. <laughs> here goes nothing. Good? Of course. <laughs> My hero. Never a dull moment with you. That a compliment? Uh, not really. <laughs> Thanks anyway. We're getting closer to the station. Even So, we'll probably run into a few monsters on the way. Hmm. Huh. There's a face that screams, so what? Eh, I fought scarier things in my sleep. Where are you going, Cloud? The station is the other way? Don't overdo it. Here goes. <laughs> this one's for you. Get ready. Just a bit. Someone looks like they're in their element. Uh, 
Well, this isn't good. That's it! You'll see. That's the world I know. <laughs> you sound proud of that. Uh. Stations there. I can see that. Oh? Thought the world you knew didn't include stations. Ha ha. I can't believe this is happening. If you would all just please calm down. Hey! What the hell's going on? Check it out, Come Mom. on. There's no need to shout. Popular place. Yeah. Well, it's got a good view of the reactor. It's on fire! In the show. They know that. Don't worry. Oh, didn't expect to see you here. Turk. A real man on a mission. On the hunt, more like. For me? For you? Don't know. Don't care. Then, let's stick to the back streets? Ah. There will be monsters. Better than Shinra. There's a Shinra dump site up ahead. Not the kind of place anyone would ever choose to hang around in. But a great place to lay low. They've got the run of it. Enough! That's that. No telling where they'll come from. Ma. 
Monsters instinctively target weaker prey. Hmm. You'd better watch out then, Cloud. <laughs> <laughs> but quit halfway. Over here. That didn't work. Maybe it's broken? Pretty sure this papyron loops around too, so... Hmm, wonder if we can move... for the stronger prey. time for that you'll want to make time for my mom's cooking and that's the final word on it we'll get home quick and eat ourselves stupid
it's awake. No way she kept sleeping. So long. <laughs> Nothing to it. Don't think it'll open. What to do? That gate just doesn't want to open, does it? Maybe there's a way to get over it? For you, at least. Yes, we're home free. No need for thanks. They're out of the You're getting paid right now. Hmm? Huh? Forget about the Turks. Ah. Could come at us in. in time. Hmm. Keep an eye out. Hmm. So, do you think this means another the world? The second life slows are right there. God, I'm so nervous. What are they watching? Hey! I made a first You heard what they said. According to officials, you are not I'm standing inside the gutted shell of Mako Reactor 5. They're working for Wu Tai, isn't it obvious? There's still a lot of smoke rising from the rubble. So they don't have to break While fallen beams and other debris continue to hinder rescue efforts, the fires of fear have been mostly extinguished. we help catch the bombers, we get a reward or something? That's the director of Shinra's advanced weaponry division, isn't it? Enough of that doom and Excuse me, ma'am, but, but would you mind answering a few questions? No. Uh, They're targeting reactors. No Can you give us any updates on the status of the reactor? So what kind of damage did it suffer in the again. explosion? Are we in any danger? Uh, Mako Reactor 5 has been temporarily shut down, and all fires have been successfully extinguished. The situation is under control, and the people of our fair city need not worry about any additional complications. We're in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation, but we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. The perpetrators of that atrocity were filmed making their escape. These agents of the eco-terrorist group Avalanche are currently believed to be in hiding somewhere in Midgar. And uh, given that this group has now attacked two reactors in quick succession, can they really be stopped before they strike again? What do you think? Uh, well, uh. <laughs> Have no fear. Shinra will keep Midgar safe. 
Okay, time's up. All right, let's go. Why the hell would anyone do that? Oh, what timing. Mind lending me a hand? Place is really hopping, huh? Nice side effect of the train situation. So, what do you say? I'd love to, but... I help out every now and then. It's fun. Eris! Well, well. What are you doing all the way up there? Was trying to get a look at the reactor. Who's this guy? This is Cloud. He's a mercenary. And currently my bodyguard. That's Oats. See you. Two peas in a pod. What are you guys up to? We all went to see the reactor. Oh, that's right. You're supposed to come by the house. Uh, what for? I don't know. You're just supposed to. Well, guess we have a new destination. I should probably explain. The Leaf House is the local orphanage. That's where all these kids live. Hey, Aerith, where'd you go? The church again? Next time, we should all go together. Uh... Why, hello, Aerith. As popular as ever, I see. Apparently, but they sure keep me on my toes. <laughs> uh, better than being bedridden. Thanks again for all those herbs. You've helped a lot of people. No problem. Anytime. How'd you manage to find so many anyway? <laughs> oh, I have my ways. And him? He's my bodyguard, just until I get home. And you're sure he's up to it? Hmm, maybe. Since I'm so generous, I gather yeah, medicinal yeah, herbs for his patients like sometimes. Like Here's that. the leaf house. There you are. We're back, and we brought Aerith with us. Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, I thought some flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will, and I'd love to help. Let's all wash up before our meal. Hey, mister, do you want one of these? Biggs gave me a bunch of his favorites, and I'm gonna read them all. So, Cloud, what's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm? What? Thought you didn't like lying. <sighs> well, anyway. My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. There you go. That's my house. It's amazing. <laughs> Up to no good? Rude came by. So, this is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. <laughs> or was my job. 
Yep. Thanks. So, Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. <laughs> then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly, I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you'd just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. Hold up. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the Leaf House. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way? Do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <sighs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. That Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? Aerith won't be long. It must be tough. No, never mind. Take this one. Huh? Uh, Take it. Uh, uh, hmm. uh, right. Off we go. <sighs> and these right here are my babies. Do you think we should pick any of them? Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. That's the one I gave you. Huh, it is nice try, mister. You can't fool me. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Whoa, foxtails, huh? I gotta hand it to you. I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? under the gun or anything I'm not cut out for this crap sure you are and when you're done you'll be drowning in job offers
So, how do you think they'll arrange these flowers? Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? Must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it. Cloud, I have the most amazing news. I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia, something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. You've made your preparations. You won't stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. A portion of all proceeds goes to the Leaf House.
still at it. Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. off-limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. Oats! You're back! Aerith's come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. <laughs> 